Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, it's me Nelly again, no the bomb job. Let me start off by saying Happy New Year, Happy 2019. Um, is everyone enjoying their 2019 so far? Um, I just wanted to, you know, um, be my this is my first official video of 2019. A life update for you guys. Uh, nobody probably knows this, but um, I'm back at home. I'm back in Philly. I did not go back to Bloomsburg, the school that I was um, attending, the school that I attended last year. Uh, for those who don't know, I am back at home. I've been back at home for a while. You know, for those who do know that I was away at school um, last school year. Um, that's where my school vlogs came into play. And, but this school year, I was not there. I haven't been there. Um, the reason why is because I was academically dismissed. Do well. During my time there, I didn't do well as I anticipated. Um, I thought I was going to do very well. And I didn't, I did my best, however my best wasn't good enough. I got accepted uh, to Bloomsburg on my birthday, my 21st birthday. I was so excited, I was so happy. I feel like I accomplished something, because being at, you know, two two-year schools for as long as I have, I, I was like, tired of seeing the same things over and over. Like, you know, don't get me wrong, I love my city. I love my city, I love Philly, but at the time I just was tired of seeing the same things. I just needed to get out of here and Bloomsburg was my ticket out. But the crazy thing about it is Bloomsburg wasn't like the first school I thought of when it came to um, applying to. I originally applied to Coppin State University and Wharton State University, which are both uh, colleges in Maryland and they're both um, HBCUs and I didn't get accepted and I was just like okay let me just apply to one of these state schools here and Bloomsburg was one of those schools that I got accepted to so I was like it was more like um, a might as well type thing and like ever since then I think that's when the downfall began because um, like my mom and I didn't have money to even go up there like the day after my acceptance. Because the week that I got accepted, like the week of my birthday, that was moving week. And um, like that was moving week and then I thought I was like, alright, well, like that week and I could just move up there and move on. But uh, that wasn't the case. I moved in the week after which was like the first week of school i didn't know which classes i wanted to take just picked random classes and um i was really overwhelmed with every class that i took i was very overwhelmed with all the classes that i was taking and very stressed more than usual i mean I feel like the only good thing about me going there was me having my own room. I was living in a suite, a quad suite. I didn't like my suite mates. Like for those who watched my college vlogs, y'all know I did not like my suite mates one bit. I did not like them. Um, it was really hard living with them. And um I mean, like, yeah, the building was nice, you know, people that I met were nice, but it was just, I felt lost. Like, I didn't know which major I wanted to be in. Mom was like, just pick anything, but, like, that's not my thing. I wanted to, um, pick a major that I was going to be happy with, and the thing with being undecided is, like, when you see, like, the different majors, like, either you can make money or be happy. And like the majors where you can make money in the end, a lot of people are not really happy in the end. And but then when they choose the happy route, they don't make as much money. 
so I just stayed undecided and I was just very lost and didn't really know what I wanted to do. I just felt like I was there just to be there. Like there were times where I was like, oh my God, what am I doing? Like I really just didn't know what I wanted to do. And like when I failed the first semester, a part of me was like, I felt like I wanted to go home. But I, like, you know, I was happy that I was away. And, but I didn't like my situation when being away. So, when I was academically dismissed, um, about like the month that I came back, I felt defeated. I felt very defeated. I was like, oh my god, now I have to come back home. And I didn't want to be home. I really didn't. And, um, I really didn't want to be back at home. I was like, okay, maybe I can be at this school, that school, that school. And at that point, I actually found what I wanted to do. Um, I've been doing YouTube for about three and a half years now. And I was like, maybe I can do a major, like, surrounding that. Like, maybe I can, like, get into a major where I can be better at what I'm doing, which is YouTube, so. And, you know, this one school uh, here in Pennsylvania, um, I can get, like, a certificate of some sort, and I was planning on doing that. And I did get accepted into that school, but, like, my financial aid issue, I had a little issue with financial aid, so. And plus, mom, you know. She was like, oh, we don't have the money because we still have to pay this bill off from Bloomsburg. And, you know, I decided to go back to CCP. I did, like, a summer class. And then, um, you know, of course, I did fall 2018. I did very well. Um, I could have done better, but I did, you know, well. And now, um, in spring 2019, I'm taking classes that I want to take. My major is digital video production, and I'm also getting an acting certificate. I'm actually going to be in a play uh, in a matter of six weeks, and I can't wait, and I'm very excited. I'm also, so I'm taking two acting classes, and I'm also taking intro to video production. I was actually planning on taking it in the summer, but it was full, and I was planning on taking it in the fall, and it was also full, so I was so happy when um it was like one spot left and i grabbed onto it i was like yes so yeah so i am doing good we just did a silent film i post a silent film that my group did and um yeah it was it was a lot <laughs> it was really stressful but um yeah I learned a lot while I was being up on square, but it was just like, <sighs> I felt like I was just away just to be away because I hated being at home like the first three years. I hated being home. It's like being away from home was like refreshing, but I feel like I was away for the wrong reasons and I can admit that I was away from home for the wrong reasons. But, you know, I'm not sure, like, with me failing from Bloomsburg, I feel like I've ruined my chances of ever being away from home ever again. So I was just like, oh man, like, I want to go away again, but I feel like I'm afraid that I might fuck up. But, I mean, we'll see, I'm not sure, but, um... I just hope that this semester and the summer will be better. Um, yeah, I just, yeah, like, I'm, like, I'm happy that I'm doing better now, like, I've done better at CCP than any other school that I've ever been to, but, uh, yeah, I'm happier now, it's like, it's hard to think about going away when everything's so good now, yeah, but, I just wanted to let you know what's going on in my life. 
um more vlogs are coming soon more makeup videos coming soon so make sure to like comment and subscribe um make sure to follow my social media handles